right, 27. Rebecca has three and five six feet of fabric that she will use to make bookmarks, and she's going to use two thirds foot of fabric to make each bookmark. And after Rebecca has made all of the bookmarks possible with the fabric, what length of fabric in feet will not have been used to make bookmarks? So when we're trying to figure out what is left over, we are talking about remainders. So should be some sort of division problem and we will find out what is left over. So, and that leftover bit is what we care about. So we have to divide the amount of fabric that she has by the length of fabric used to make each bookmark. To make this a little bit easier for myself, uh, do not be intimidated by fractions, please, please, please. Uh, I'm just gonna change the first uh, first value into a um, improper fraction from a mixed number. Uh, it's gonna be six times three is 18, plus five is 23 over six and we are going to divide that by two-thirds uh, remember that division by a fraction is multiplication by its reciprocal there's a little bit of reduction that can go on here so three divided by six that's a half so one over two and that will be 23 times one is 23 over two times two which is four and so if we do 23 divided by 4, we get 5.75. Okay, 5.75. We have to consider what this means. This is the number of bookmarks that Rebecca can make. So she can make 5 and then 0.75 bookmarks. Well, the 0.75 is the leftover. That means that she can make 0.75, or if we think about 0.75, right? What is 0.75 as a percentage? I mean, 0.75 is effectively 75%, right? So she can make five whole bookmarks, and then she can make 75% of another bookmark. Well, that is where we're going to get our answer, because if each bookmark is two-thirds of a foot, or needs two-thirds of a foot uh, of fabric, we can find 75% of that. So we could multiply that by 0.75. Of course, you could multiply that by 3 over 4 if you recognize that 0.75 is 3 over 4. So if we take 2 thirds, I would recommend putting this in your calculator as a fraction uh, because you do want to carry it out. It won't mess you up. You should probably get close if you use 0.666, but carry it out. So times 0. 0 0.75 and then we end up with 0.5 okay so that is our amount of feet we end up with half a foot so C is our answer